Welcome to our LEGO Star Wars Hoth Mock. Last week we worked on the secret ice cave. This week the mountain work continues and there's a special scene at the end of the video. So let's get building. All right, it's been a few weeks since we put in some serious build time on the front of Echo Base Mountain, uh, right behind the trench. And uh, something that's been bothering me for a long time, and I keep saying I'm gonna fix it, and I never do, is cleaning up the last of the multicolored bricks. But we are gonna inch ever closer as we build out from the door and down Echo Base Mountain, getting ever closer to the multicolored bricks and the shield generator. But first things first, just like we built up on the left side of the Echo Base door to the top of the mountain, we have to do the same over here. That'll keep it nice and straight all the way across. One of the things that's gonna be tough about doing this is this part is right smack dab in the middle of the mock, and I'm not gonna be laying on top of this. So fortunately, Leaky has really long reach. Stretch Armstrong, your stretchable superhero. So I should be able to do it, but it's gonna be tricky. So that's where we're gonna to start today. And don't forget to stick around to the end of the video because we're gonna be putting a brand new minifigure down on the board somewhere. Where will it be? I don't know. Anyways, let's move over to hyperlapse mode and continue building on the top of the mountain. I'm gonna take a quick break here to see how this is looking. It's pretty consistent all the way along down to what assistant did down there. So looking pretty good. So now I'm gonna keep on moving until I get to this part here where it's like a little bit of a crevice, a cavern, a crevice, I don't know what it is. But I'm gonna go all the way to there. Let's move back to hyperlapse mode and get this next section done. I got to the point where I can finally fill in the multicolored madness. So the front of the mountain looking very good. I did sprinkle in some more gray pieces. Just a few just to keep it subtle. Just a little dirt. So now it's time to fill this in. And this is going to be a little tricky because these are snot bricks pushed right up against the edge. I have to make a base with plates above this so I can build the mountain off of it. And I do have to end it right at this edge to where the shield generator is gonna be because we have to lift that guy up. So this I'm gonna do off camera instead of hyperlapse. Just build the foundation of this, see how it turns out, and then we'll come back. All right, so I built this little ledge right along here, and I think I am gonna stop there. Next thing we are gonna do is lift the shield generator up. So we need this little lip to basically bridge between the command center area and the mountain. So I'm gonna stop right here, bring assistant in, have him review the work today, and then we'll put a minifigure on the board. Okay, so Leaky has been hard at work working on the mountains over here, and they're looking really good. Uh, you know, it's just an extension to what we've already built, and this is kind of the height of where we want our mountains to be. I don't think we're gonna make them any higher, uh, and I like this height. Uh, there's a nice thick chunk of ice above the door, so it does look like, uh, you know, they've carved out the base into a mountain rather than, you know, a mountain built around a base, which is really not the effect we're going for. Uh, so now that the mountain is very vast and big and the door is just kind of like a little cutout, I'm starting to like 
like that. And that effect is gonna be amplified when we finish what we're going to be doing over there with the shield generator. Like Leaky was saying, that whole entire area right there needs to be lifted up. The shield generator is sitting way too low. I want it to be definitely a little higher. Um, and then we're gonna have to kind of round that corner out there and have the shield generator sitting on a platform, if you will, kind of in comparison to the rest. And then the mountain will follow that curve and go back to give the mountain even more depth and make it seem like less of a bay, or less of a base built around a mountain and a mountain with a base carved out of it, if that makes any sense. But it should be pretty cool. And this is definitely a step closer towards our goal of, you know, finishing out the mock and getting everything built up over here. But that's probably going to do it as far as building in this episode. But do not fear, we still have to add a minifigure. And as far as our minifigure goes, it's actually going to be Princess Leia. I don't know if you guys remember, but I really wanted to add the scene where she was hyping up all the drivers and kind of going over the plan brief uh, for the incoming invasion. Two fighters against a Star Destroyer. The Ion Cannon will fire several shots to make sure that any enemy ships will be out of your flight path. So that is what we're going to do today as far as minifigures go. We have Miss Princess Leia here. Uh, and what we're going to do is we're just going to take her and add her to the scene. That's right, guys. Today is a one for five. That's right, people. Five minifigures are getting added today. Uh, as of right now, we're just putting Princess Leia there with a couple of captain or fighters, pilots there, along with Mustachio, just like he is in the scene. Mustachio! With, with the uh, Millennium Falcon in the background. In the future, of course, we're gonna add a ton more, probably a whole second row of captains or fighter pilots here uh, that are gonna be in around the side. Maybe one guy right here and probably, I don't know, six or seven in the back. Uh, and then maybe a few more for like a, a total of nine more figures right there. So that's gonna be a pretty big group uh, that I I think is really gonna fill out the base and as so can you imagine nine more figures there uh, and then with larger groups like this guy in the back and then we're gonna I want to add some more figures over to this area to make them a larger group and same thing goes with this guy I kind of want to add two more figures there uh, and then some more people working on the x-wings and same goes for the snow speeders uh, I also want to cluster some minifigures around all of these power units because there's like at least two guys to three guys working on each of these power stations and we only have one so that's kind of where we look at our minifigure collection here where all of these guys are going to fit in to our mock so definitely a lot to look forward to in the future on the minifigure front, but that also means that we're gonna be adding a lot of Rebel Troopers and fighter pilots to the Hoth base going forward. So sorry about that, guys. Hey, Assistant, I don't know if you noticed, but on Wednesday, we did a minifigure count. We counted up both Tatooine, which had 268 minifigures, and we counted up Hoth, which right now, these five uh, only has 147 so i like all those extra minifigures you're playing because we got some catching up to do with yeah i mean we definitely have a lot of catching up to do on hoth but we are going to make it there i want hoth to be the most populated low bricks mock as far as minifigures go uh, because it is the biggest and like i said i want this base to be teething with life because they're all trying to get the hell out of here because i mean look at that uh, and that that's a little pointy. I don't like it one bit. But anyway, guys, as far as today's video go, we got a lot of the mountain work done here. Uh, you know, extending our mountain out further uh, into the future, you know, we're gonna be extending it more. But as of right now, that is starting to look really, really, really good. So if you wanna see us continue to work on our Hoth mock, definitely subscribe because you know, you'll get notifications or whatnot. I don't know how YouTube works, I've never used it. But anyway guys, that's gonna do it for this video and I will see ya in the next one.